Hi, Tattler. I'm Diane Kruger, and I am very excited to answer a few questions for you. So the World Cup is a really great time for me because I am German originally, but I'm an honorary French girl. Uh, I've lived here 25 years, so it's a win-win situation for me. Should the Germans win? Great. Should the French win? Equally as great. Pippi Longstocking. <laughs> oh my, <laughs> my intellect is really coming through. No, only because, you know what, I, I just wrote a, a children's book, right? And so, and I have a young daughter, so I've been reading a lot of children's books at home. And Pippi Longstocking was, without a doubt, my favorite character in books and movies when I was growing up. And I just loved her freedom and her, you know, she was so smart um, and witty. And so I think she would be really fun to have tea with. I will definitely go with Bratwurst over Toad in the Hall. Like, Bratwurst is definitely the most German thing about me that I love. In fact, there is a open-air deli that is open all night in Berlin, and you can stop at any time and you can get a glass of champagne with it. Oh, I'm gonna go with champagne. Now, less of a headache. One accessory I can't live without would have to be just a black trench coat. It never goes out of style, especially in, in France. <laughs> I wore like a really great like black lace Chanel dress uh, to the Met one year that I loved. A lot of Chanel, I would say, in my past. When I look back, it's so classic, you know, and, and kind of stands the test of time. It has to be this Marquesa dress that I wore uh, to the Golden Globes many, many moons ago. And it literally was a genie dress. And it was just so inappropriate and totally, I'd never been to the Golden Globes, but still, somebody should have told me, you don't show your belly button at the Golden Globes. And Paul de Bras is a, is a ballet uh, position. It really just means, you know, going from one arm position and the other, you say, porte de bras. Say that again? <laughs> Devenir chèvre. I mean, it literally means becoming a goat. So I'm not sure exactly what it means in a, in a slang. Ah, oh, devenir chèvre, yeah. So devenir chèvre, yeah, I guess. You're right, it means being a little 